Do you think a country that has as its formal policy, as a matter of law, the extermination of a class of human being, you think that that, that country can be pleasing to God? Do you think a country that's guilty of genocide, mass murder, do you think that country can be pleasing to God? No matter what else it does that's good, can that country be pleasing to God? I don't think so. Listen, the Catholic Church holds, and rightly so, that life begins at conception. There is no other rational, uh, logical, or moral position. Life begins at conception, and science backs that up as well. That's not a, just a matter of religion. That's a matter of common sense and science. Life begins at conception. If you're Catholic and Christian, you have to believe that. If you don't, then you're basically a heretic, and you've separated yourself from the body of Christ. Life begins at conception, no exceptions. Life begins at conception. It's a human being from the moment of conception on. Abortion, in a single case, is homicide. The popes have said that. Pope John Paul II called it murder in plain English. Abortion is murder. A single abortion is a homicide. Then what, may I ask, would 48 million and counting abortions be? That's genocide. More than 48 million abortions in the United States of America since Roe versus Wade. Genocide. By definition, the taking of the life of almost 50 million innocent, totally vulnerable human beings. That's the law of the land. And, and why? Is there, why, why? How can they defend it? Well, a woman has a right to choose. Hold on. A right to choose what? A right to choose to murder another innocent human being? No woman, no man, has the right to murder another innocent human being. Now that's in your face, clear as a bell, truth. And there are many who will not accept it. And those people are well on their way to destroying this country. Let me tell you something. All the economic chaos you've been seeing in recent times, all the chaos in general, Trace it right back to the gross immorality, the legal immorality, of the taking of the life of innocent human beings. Everything else pales into utter insignificance 